not something you should be putting in your gas tank. Here it goes. That's so damn sticky. It's running really bad. It's cranking, but now the engine's not starting. So over the months, I've happened to put a lot of things in here. I made a few videos about pouring things in the gas tank. You know, usually there are things you would pour in the gas tank just overusing them. But I'm like, ah, come on, I can do better. Like, we know what's going to happen, right? It's made to go in there in the first place. It's not like putting something that doesn't absolutely belong in the gas in the gas. Like, oh, I don't know this. So I thought to myself, man, I could really make an interesting video if I put something that definitely doesn't belong in the gas. So I thought, hey, let's see what happens after you pour this in the gas. I mean, who knows? Maybe nothing will happen at all. And that's what we're here to find out. So let's go ahead and do our Canadian tune-up. I mean, maybe this will work better than the Italian tune-up. So I'm gonna undo this here and if you want to know if this has really maple syrup yes look how look how sticky it is definitely not something you should be putting in your gas tank so here it goes i'm gonna put the whole bottle in we'll see what happens The overflow here. It's not flowing down in the funnel the way it needed to. That's so damn sticky. All right, got most of it where it needs to go. All right, let's go ahead and get in the car here and see what happens. All right, so. Uh, just go ahead and turn it on. Fire's up. All right. Seems like it's running pretty good. Guess I need to give it some time uh, just for everything to get cycled through. Um, so I'm just gonna let it idle here a minute. Let it warm up. So far, so good. It is pretty warm outside, as you can see. Good old Florida weather. I mean, I guess just like how thicker oil helps protect the engine, maybe adding syrup to the fuel system will help protect the fuel system when because everything's so hot i mean it would increase the viscosity of the gas right who knows maybe this will be canada's new claim to fame for their fuel treatment putting canada back on the map for maple syrup not only good on your pancakes great in your fuel system coming soon to an auto parts store near you full synthetic maple syrup well, still so far so good. I mean, the car's idling just fine. I think, I think we need to go for a drive and see what happens. So I guess let's do that. All right, and off we go. Oh, okay. It just died on me. Let's see if it starts back up. Oh, that just made a weird noise. Okay, let's put it back in gear. Oh, it's running really bad. Let's put it back in gear. Okay. That's weird, man. Okay, start it up again. Oh, uh-oh. Oh no. It's cranking, but now the engine's not starting. Uh-oh. Um. Oh boy. I guess, let me see if it's throwing any codes. See if there's a check engine light, cause I, I don't even know at this point. Plug that in. Oh, see what we got. Okay, so evapor evaporative emission system detected. One four, that's fuel system. Misfire detected on startup. System fuel pressure too low. Oh, okay. Perhaps it was not a good idea of putting, uh, 
maple syrup in the gas tank. Looks like it just clogged up my fuel system. Well, I guess there's just some things you do on video and some things you don't. So Canadian tune-up, no good. No wonder Canada sucks, Jesus. Yeah, definitely, definitely not the greatest idea. Nope, not one bit. Well, anyway, I think that's gonna wrap it up here because I have nothing else to do than call a tow truck. So, anywho, uh, if you found the video entertaining, I guess give it a thumbs up and share it with everyone you know. That way I get some ad revenue to pay for the repair. And if you wanna see more videos like this and you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and keep a look at the next Crazy Cars Created video.